Hey guys, today we're going to jump into the new stage of the Cell Max event. It's called Horrendous Calamity. Uh, so there is a mission that uh, I think it requires that we take in one super class character of each typing. And then I think there's the same thing for extreme class. Uh, so we're going to do the first run through this with the super class team here, one of each uh, typing. This is, of course, the superhero team. Uh, I am going to be using God Goku, I think, in the Beast Gohan Rainbow Showcase. I think I did end up using the same team, except I used Orange Piccolo instead of uh, God Goku, of course. But uh, God Goku is a very good option for this event. Once you reach a certain point, I think it's four turns in or five turns in, Cell Max actually is, at that point, going to be able to be affected by sealing. Uh, which, of course, God Goku does on his super attack effect. So... We're going to jump in with the superhero team. Obviously, the superhero team is very good, but this stage is hard. I'm pretty sure Cell Max is opening up with like two and a half million super attacks or something, turn one. So it's just going to become a matter of if we get caught, we die. <laughs> That's just the way. To, well, besides Beast, I guess. Um, so we'll go ahead and jump in with the superhero team here and uh, we'll see how things go. Again, if we have to change anything as usual, we will make adjustments. But uh, I'm pretty confident that Superhero should be able to handle business here. Unfortunately, we... Well, I mean, it's not the worry. We have the two 6th anniversary characters together on the second turn. That's good. Okay. You know what? Sure. All right, so the good thing about Beast Gohan is he has a very, very, very easy active skill condition. We only need to get hit one time, and then we can go ahead and use his active skill. Um, this is actually the first time I'm using the support memory, too, by the way. This is a superhero support memory, the death of Gamma, Gamma 2. Um, that's a lot of rainbow orbs. We have a double rainbow orb changing rotation. All right, we're obviously going to put Beast in slot 1. I will float off Gogeta, I guess. Uh, I'm a little hesitant to float Gogeta just because if Cell Max is supering at the end, I'm pretty sure we die. Pretty sure Gogeta will die to that. Um, but I'd rather float him anyway, so we'll do that. God Goku will do this. And Gogeta, we will do this. Actually, no, I want to save those for the Gammas. Do that. Okay. Well, let's see. This guy's a lot of health. This is a one phase fight, but I mean, he's got he's got a lot of health. Yeah, <laughs> he's got a lot of health. All right, we're in for the long haul here. I just recorded the Red Zone movie boss rush stage video, and it's like. This is probably around the same length as the Red Zone movie boss rush stage. Because of how much damage reduction and health this guy has. Even though he's only one phase. Oh, you're gonna super beast Gohan. Well, I mean that's not gonna it's not gonna bear fruit for you. <laughs> nice super attack. Uh, I mean if he's gonna super beast, we're fine. I think this guy could double super actually. I think. I don't exactly remember 100 percent Pretty sure he can double super, so it would be. It would be wonderful if uh, either he, you don't do that on this turn, or we will dodge the super. If you do super, go do that. I will see. 11 million, okay. I'm very worried about the Gammas. The Gammas, as long as they can just avoid getting sniped, they'll be okay, but uh, we'll see. Okay. Okay. All right. UI Goku has 100% dodge here. <sighs> what are the chances he supers at the end? Pretty high. It's pretty high, right? Um, I'm actually gonna put Vegeta in slot one just so we can get his some of his hits in here. Man, do I? I don't want to split this rotation up. 
But I mean, we, we actually cannot put the gammas there, right? We just can't do that. I think we have to do this, unfortunately. It, it's not what I would like to do, but I think we have to. I think we have to. All right, we can do this. Two int orbs, and then UI can grab that. Okay, he is supering right away. <laughs> this could do damage, obviously, but Vegeta should be fine. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. Think about how ridiculous that is. Vegeta has 50% damage reduction and guard. And he took almost 400k from that. That is crazy. All right, well. So Vegeta is two hits away from getting his revive active. The Gammas are definitely okay against normals, right? They're gonna get the uh, multiple supers in here. Just need one more attack so they can get their damage reduction. Perfect. You can give me one more. They wanna show out here. Perfect. Okay, there we go. Yeah, they're definitely fine. And then UI Goku will get some build up in slot three as well. I think he's attacking three times. Contemplating whether or not I want to use Beast's active skill already. Uh, probably we don't need to on this rotation. Let's put the friend in slot one. Or sorry, mine in slot one. Just because I want to make sure that we can get my uh, beast on this rotation so we can use my active skill in the next turn if we need to. God, Goku, I'm going to give you all these orbs. Actually, yeah, we need, we need to do this. If God, Goku gets super, I think he would take like 300k. <laughs> So we want to make sure we're at least able to survive. Uh, and then Beast, it doesn't really matter. I, I would like to be able to get Int Orbs with the Gammas. There we go. That's, that's, that actually works out really well. Another instant super. This could actually do a little bit of damage here. We'll see. Yeah, actually did that. I've never seen... That's the first time I've ever seen my Beast Gohan take anything besides double digits. It's a lot of damage. He took, he almost took 100k damage. That's crazy. All right, well, I think we're going to move, start moving into the turns of this fight where we can start debuffing him. That's where this God Goku's going to really shine. All right, here's the friend beast. This is a scary turn. This is a very, very scary turn. I also realized that Gogeta Rainbow Orb changed the uh, Int Spheres. Uh, I think if we make it through this turn, I'm pretty sure we win. It's just a matter of if we make it through this turn or not. Um, I re Unfortunately, I think we have to do this. So the two ways we lose here. Actually, there could be three ways we lose here. 
The Gammas eat a super. Gogeta doesn't dodge and eats a super. And I think if if Cell Max supers Vegeta first attack at the end, I'm pretty sure we would die. Would we die? I, I don't know if we take 700k. Th there's a world where like Gogeta eats a normal, and then we take like 400k from a normal with on Gogeta, and then Vegeta would die to a super. That's the thing that could happen, I think. All right, we'll we'll just have to hope that none, none of those scenarios actually happen. I should probably just proc this. I could save it for a better, better damage turn. I'm gonna save it for for a better damage turn. I think. Do I? Yeah, I'll save it. I'm gonna make sure I give the gammas their orbs, and then Vegeta can get you max key. All right, just survive this turn, and we should be good. Gogeta has to dodge everything, and then the gammas have to not take a super. And then Vegeta has to, I think, take one normal first. <laughs> a lot of hoops. I actually don't know how much damage Gogeta would take from a normal. I think if he quad supers, we're okay. Obviously, he can't take a super, though. All right, just one more. One more super. And then on the next turn, we'll have both Beast active and Gogeta's active. Okay, he didn't... <sighs> okay, that's not... Hello? I mean, he didn't give us... That's insane. He didn't give us the fourth attack, and then he dodged... Or, and then he ate both normals. What the hell? Watch Cell Max Super in slot two here. I mean, I'm, that's just like... Literally the worst possible outcome. If Cell Max Super is right here, it is literally the worst possible outcome. Okay, we're fine, I think. All right, Vegeta. This is the exact scenario I was just talking about where like Gogeta would eat damage from a normal and then Vegeta could die to the super right away. All right, give us a third super, Vegeta. Third super. Please give us a third super. Okay. I think we're fine. We have the Gamma support. Vegeta's fully built up. Just do a normal first cell. One normal. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're definitely we're definitely fine. Yeah. Go ahead, super. 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 Wow, no super. Okay. Um, we don't need to use Beast Active because we have UI Goku's revive here. So I don't see a reason to use it. I got I have to I'm gonna have to keep uh God Goku on rotation because of the ceiling now. Like, you can see his buff bar at the top of the screen is now basically empty. Um, he's immune to stuns right now, but I think starting with the next turn, you actually could stun him. We don't have any characters on the team that can stun. Uh, I don't think. The Gambas don't stun with, like, their 12 key when you go into Gamma 1, right? Actually, no! The Core Breaker stuns! Doesn't the Core Breaker stun? Pretty sure it does. Yeah, actually, the... I <laughs> I think the Core Breaker stuns. Uh, okay, obviously we're gonna keep God Goku here. I'm just gonna give him all these these orbs. Actually, if we're gonna put him in slot one, we don't need to. It doesn't matter. We'll we'll just we'll just do this. Sure, whatever. Uh, Beast, it doesn't matter. And then UI Goku. Let's give you Max Key. All right, again, if we die, we just revive. So it doesn't matter. I'd rather save Beast active if we can. I'm pretty sure we can't lose now because he's gonna be sealed. Like we we could we could still technically die in this turn if UI Goku gets horrible, horrible dodging luck. But we have Beast active on this turn, we have Beast active on the next turn, we have Gogeta's active on the next turn, and we have revives up on like across the board here, and we have a way to seal the boss. So I'm pretty sure at this point we actually did make it through the hardest part of the fight already. Um, there was that really iffy, so that, that what was that, what turn was that? Turn four. Turn four. Yeah, this is, hello? This is exactly what I was talking about. <laughs> what, what the hell? What is going on with the dodging in this one? Jeez. Okay, I mean. Uh, <laughs> thanks for the heal, Gogeta. Um, we're obviously going to do the core breaker here. God damn.
Okay. Um, we can afford to just, like, pop one of these active skills. I know the core breaker didn't stun because he's still immune, but I, I just wanted to get it out there because I want to get the, the gamma support rolling here. <sighs> I'm going to use beast active. Yeah, use beast active. I'm going to use beast active and I'm actually going to float him off. We'll do this. Obviously, we'll keep Gogeta around because we'll use hit. If we make it back to this turn or this rotation on turn eight, I think we'll kill him before then. But if we make it back to this rotation on turn eight, we'll just use Gogeta's active. All right, let's see. Fourteen million. We'll use my beast active on the next turn. Remember, Gamma 1 is giving two-turn defensive support to the whole team. 17.6 million, okay. Pretty sure he dies next turn, but we'll see. This beast is about to do a lot of damage. And then we still have Evolution Blue Vegeta's active skill that we never used. Alrighty. 25. We're gonna get a guaranteed additional super as well. Guaranteed crits. Okay, could give us a third. He does not, okay. I don't need to use Beast Active here because we have the Revive Active, but I just want the extra damage. And it is thematic as well. Let's give God Goku all these. Do it? Yeah, whatever. I'm pretty sure we can kill on this turn. Pretty sure we can kill here. What is beast defense? 1.5. Yeah, that's the gamma support from the other turn. We'll heal. He can super here. He does. Oh no, guys. He's super attacking. Oh no. He has lower attack, I guess. It kind of is annoying, but whatever. All right, we're going to go ahead and seal him now. God Goku putting a lot of damage here. Hey, crit. There we go. All right. I'm pretty sure we kill. No, don't dodge. 19.7. A little lower than we're used to seeing. Yeah, maybe we don't kill here. Maybe we'll finish with Gogeta on the other turn. Gogeta might put him in the ground. Because remember, we also still have UI Goku's active that we never used to. Yeah, I don't think Beast is going to take him out, actually. He has too much health left. Four. Okay, I guess we'll get the, the wind scream with Gogeta, actually. No additional, wow. Getting pretty unlucky with that. Okay, let's start with this. 
別に正義のヒーローでも何でもねえ変だな仲間を傷つけるやつは許さねえぞ All right, I don't know if this is actually going to kill him. Probably not, but we'll just have Gogeta do the active, and then we'll put him in slot one, and then he'll finish off Cellmax here. So let me know what you guys think of the new stage of the Cellmax event. Very, very difficult fight. Again, the first few turns really are just don't super my characters that can't dodge and are not immortal to damage, and <laughs> that's it. Just put your hands up and say, okay, uh, please don't do that. But yeah, overall, uh, superior team, very good. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next one.